Going. Is, will you tell me that? His son was but a ward two years ago. What ladies that with doth enrich the hand of yonder knight? I know not, sire. Oh, she doth teach the torches to burn bright. It seems she hangs upon the cheek of night as a rich jewel in Ethiop's ear. Beauty is too rich for use, for earth too dear. So shows a snowy dove trooping with crows. As yonder lady o'er oh, her fellows shows, the measure done, I'll watch her place her stand, and touching hers, make blessed my rude hand, did my heart love till now, forswear its sight, for I ne'er saw true beauty till this night. This, by his voice, should be among you. Fetch me my rapier boy. What dares the slave, come hither covered with antic face, to fleer or to scorn our solemnity? Now, by the stock of Harner, my kin, to strike him dead, I hold it not to sin. Why, how now, kinsman? Wherefore storm you so? Uncle, this is a Montague, our foe, a villain that is hither come in spite to scorn at our solemnity this night. Young Romeo, is it? Tis he that did in Romeo. Content thee, gentle cub, let him alone. He bears him like a portly gentleman. And to say that truth, Verona brags of him to be virtuous and a well-governed youth. I would not for the wealth of all this town, here in my house, to him disparage my Therefore be patient, take no note of him. It is my will, the which if thou respect. Show a fair present and put off these frowns, an ill beseeming semblance for, the, for a feast. It fits when such a man is a guest. I'll not endure him. He shall be endured. What goodman, boy? I say he shall. Go to. Am I the master here, or you? Go to. You'll not endure him. God shall mend my soul. You'll make him a mu you'll make a mutiny among my guests. You'll set a cockahoo. You'll be the man. Why, uncle? Tis a shame. Go to. Go to. You are a saucy boy. Is it so indeed? This trick may chance to scathe you. I know that. You must contrary me. Mary, tis time. Well said, my hearts. You are a princox. Go, be quiet, or more light, more light for shame. I'll make you quiet. What cheerly my hearts! Patience, perforce, with with folk, uncle, to our meeting makes my fleck tremble in a different greeting. With this withdrawal, but this intrusion shall now seeming sweet covenant to the business gall. <laughs> No, 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 no. If I profane with my unworthiest hand, this holy shrine, the gentle fine is this. My lips, two blushing pilgrims, ready stand to smooth that rough touch with a tender kiss. Good pilgrim, you do wrong to hand too much. Which mannerly devotion shows in this? For saints have hands that pilgrims hands to touch, and palm to palm, and holy palmers kiss. Have not.